five years on the East Coast, it was time to go home. Welcome to Los Santos Airport. What's up? Carl is sweet. What's up, sweet? What you want? This mama. She's dead, bro. I'll take that, Hernandez. Hey, that's my paper, man. That's money. This is drug money. It's my money, man. Hey, don't worry about it. I'll fill it out later. <sighs> Welcome home, Carl. Glad to be back. You haven't forgotten about us, have you, boy? Hell no, Officer Tampenny. I was just wondering what took you all so long. Get in the car. Ease up, man. Damn. Watch your head. Ah. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Get out of here, you greaseball bastard! Stupid Mexican. Oh, hey, sorry. My bad. Hey, man, my bad. How you been, Carl? How's your wonderful family? I'm here to bury my moms. You know that. Yeah, I guess I do. So what else you got shaking, Carl? Nothing. I live in Liberty City now. I'm clean. Legit. Nah, you ain't never been clean, Carl. Well, what do we got here? This is a weapon, Officer Pulaski, that was used to gun down a police officer not ten minutes ago. Officer Pendleberry. A fine man, I might add. You work fast, nigga. You know I just got off the plane. Well, that's a good thing we found you and retrieved the murder weapon. That ain't my gun. Don't bullshit me, Carl. Yeah, don't bullshit him, Carl. What the fuck you want from me this time? When we want you, we'll find you. In the meantime, try not to gun down any more officers of the law. <laughs> Y'all can't leave me here. This ball is country. I thought you said you was innocent, Carl. But you don't bang. This is car 58. See you around like a donut, what? Carl. <laughs> I'll just... Oh, shit. Here we go again. Worst place in the world. Rolling Heights baller country. Now, I ain't represented Grove Street in five years. But the ballers won't give a shit. Street, home. At least it was before I fucked everything up. Why 
this had to happen. But I promise you, I'm gonna find out who killed your moms. The streets is cold, dog. Like it says in the book, we are blessed and cursed. What fucking book? Same things make us laugh, make us cry. But right now, we gotta take care of our business. Go see your brother at the cemetery. Come on, let's bounce. You wanna drive? Yeah, that's cool. Nice car, Smoke. You know me. It's not cut. Keep the value in it. Keep it real. I miss you these five years, man. They're gonna be real happy to see you. Hey, what's up, y'all? Look who I found hanging around. Carl, hey. Good to see you. I can't believe she gone, man. That's another funeral you ran away from, fool. Just like Brian's. Hey, she was my mama too. Not for the past five years she wasn't, nigga. And where the fuck you think you going? What? Get out my face. I'm going to see Caesar. The hell you are, girl. You ain't messing with them essays. You know we beat them. They ain't nothing but a Look, bunch I of low lives. Look, what the fuck are you? At least I got Prince. Oh, and I guess that makes you an upstanding American. Carl, tell him. Carl, don't tell me shit, As long bitch. as he treat her right, disrespect you, and he did. How the hell you gonna say that? Like it's any business of yours. Fuck you, sweet. Oh, shit. Asshole. Here we go again. This shit's real fucked up. Everything. What you mean? What, apart from your mother being dead? Things are going real bad. Here, here, let me show you, running man. Tony's buried over there. Little devil over there. It, big devil over there. Man, it's just crazy. Everybody blasts on fools first, then ask questions second. Ballers! Drive by! Income! Oh, mother! Oh. We gotta get back to the hood, man. It's too crazy around here. Grab a bike and pedal. Either you ain't forgotten that. Follow my lead. Take you back some, huh, CJ? Yeah. Things has changed around here. They CJ, watch your back around here, man. I get so bad. I thought this was family's yeah. turn. Yeah, it's Temple Drive family. Ah. 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 Motherfucker. You just a liability, CJ. Why you bother coming back? Straight back into the game, right, dog? Was it this bad before you left? East Coast got you all thin down, home. Got with them motherfuckers, though. 
Sold them niggas who's gangster. Why the nigga? So where you leaving, Carl? I ain't sure. Thought I might stay. Things is fucked up. <laughs> the last thing we need is your help. Ah, man, I won't let you down. I swear. Hey, we gonna call some hood rats and chill the hell out. You want some? I got a whole lot going on. I'm tired. I'll catch y'all later. Hey, yo, just drop in. We all hanging out. Gia, and get yourself some colors, fool. And a haircut. It's embarrassing to be seen with you. Good end, though. Oh, yeah, um... Hello? Hey, thought I'd explain some shit. Sweet. Hey, what's up? Since you've been away, shit has changed around here. Grove Street families ain't big no more. Seville Boulevard families and Temple Drive families are beefing and split with the Grove. Now we so busy, Cetrip and Ballers and Vargos have taken over. So watch yourself out there. Yeah, I hear you. Thanks for the heads up. Don't mention it. Man, what you want? Seeing my homie. What's up with you? Yeah, homie. Yeah, yeah, it's good to see you back. No homie love? No huh? Oh, for sure, for sure, my nigga. My bad. What's cracking with you? Hey, man, what you strapped for? Man, some pizza place keeps paying over our hit up, man. Shit is beautiful. Teach the owner a lesson. The fucking Grove Street. You damn? I'm always damn. Let's go, bitch. Show me how they drive on the East Coast, homie. Notice the traffic. Hey, O'Ree still run the barbershop? Like a raggedy-ass motherfucker. He popped his membrane years ago. The way I let that old fool in my head. Yeah, I think I'd get cut up. Whatever. You got five minutes? I'll be cutting you like a DJ. So when you running off again? I'm not. I'm thinking of staying. Why? My family, the homies is here. We were always here, fool. Yeah, but now I'm back, and I know what I've been missing. Don't expect me to kiss your ass or nothing. You still a buster to me. Yeah, okay, thanks, homie. Yeah, don't mention it. Hop in, CJ. Sit yourself down, CJ. You want it hip or fly? Beverly would have approved. Tell Big Smoke he needs a cut. Shit! I told you he was crazy. Man, you jacked up. Man, what's this? Shit look ridiculous. 
No respect for the hood. All clean and shit. <laughs> Looking too skinny, CJ. I wanna get us something to eat. I'm gonna finish this. Then I'm gonna take care of business. You want a pizza or what? Here's a blend of cheese and fat, sir. Enjoy, sir. Have a well-stacked day. Give up the money. This a raid. Ryder, not this again. It ain't me, fool. No one else is that small. I feel sorry for your dad. Shit, you crazy. Let's get up out of here. Same old CJ. Buster. Straight Buster. Oh shit! Run! This pizza parlor's no pushover. What you waiting for, fool? Take us back to the Grove, motherfucker. Uh -oh. spiritual we will find in a peace. Awesome, I can't wait. Thanks, man. Yes, we all love to travel. Get away from it all. Get away from the people with can... Jump in! That old cat got peeled. We're being forced from our homes by war or famine or whatever. Life is great! Yeah, Stop sick. ruining it! Let's call it. Hey, uh, the FBI wants to talk to me about... <laughs> collection of vacation photographs overseas and I had no idea was being taken. I mean, any taken. I have any taken control of this country. I have a lot of out of swim. I have a lot of experience with this. I want you to stop for a moment and let me read from my travel journal. I don't ever want you to keep the journal, paste pictures, notes. Sometimes people object to not taking your picture. Better drop by and see Sweet. He's been yapping on about that graffiti too. Later, homie. Come on, fat boy. Watch out, fool. Come on, fat boy. Watch this, fat watch boy. Look at, look at. Look who's here. He's running, man. What, you think you back on the set? I told you that, bro. Your word don't mean shit around here. Come on, man. Give me a break. We gotta go hit up the hood. Hey, CJ. Let them know you back on the set. The Johnson brothers are rolling again. Take this paint and go hit shit up. Start with our own set first. Later on, we spread out, take the whole hood back. You already spreading out, fat man. Let's play. Let's see what you got, poor chop. Hey, wait up. Nah, thought you hang with your brother, huh? Oh, ease up, little man. Come on, it's been difficult. You want to drive? Yeah, for sure. Stayed out there. Careful on Mary. I'm watching you right now in the shower. Notice how many lonely hearts are. Watch for those rollers as I tag this up. There's another two baller tags in the hood. You go get them and I'll keep the engine running.
Officer in need of backup. I'm gonna kick your ass. Nice and cold, thanks, man. Raise up out of here, Epples. Raise up. Epples, you gonna suck my motherfucking dick, man. I'm about to contribute to your delinquency. You want a beat down? Little help? Let's see what you got, buddy. Life may be right. Now pay up. Come on, man. Come on, let's go in the ballers' territory. Everybody, I'm here. Who you are? How old you are? So come on down and hang out with me if you're lonely. And I'm gonna tell you something. You won't be lonely for Man, the moment you walk in the door, because somebody's gonna grab your hand, and it's gonna be all about to get there from there. Good grief! That's not the way lonely hearts works at all! Is anyone here suffering? I want pain, misery, desolation, all the important things. Hi, this is Tamara. I'm a stalker. Ah, uh, that's really beautiful. Tell everyone Bitch. about it. My man. You hit this up here, and I'll go up and do another hood. Such a buster now, huh? Blame the fascist pigs. Also in gang news, customs officials report a huge influx of Russian mobsters and cheap weapons since the fall of the wall. The governor's office said everything is okay. In Vinewood news, rapper Mad Dog was celebrating the launch of his new clothing line. Richard caught up with him. The thing about Mad Dog is, I think about becoming a superstar. I mean, you know, I've done everything I can do in the rap game. One shit hands down. Nobody can handle me, you know? Lifetime champ, no shit. When I say shit. Oh, hey man, it's cool. That's cool. Okay, no shit. I got clothes. I got labels coming out, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing drinks. I got shoes, tires, rims. I'm thinking, you know, next day I should be a full-on superstar, you know? I get to wear a tight suit and nail a lot of tail. You think, you know what I do in real life? You gotta get me a drink, though, right now. Thirsty, you know? What a troubled man. Like riding bike, ain't it, boy? Yeah, it all comes back. How you doing on the Fetty? I'm kind of short, you know. Crash took all my paper, man. Left me with nothing but small change. Hey, get yourself a beer or something. I'll catch up with you. Where are all the dogs tonight? Hey, you got to keep it real, man. Man, nobody give a shit about the hood. I do. All they do is sell gay and ruin the place. No crack ever made a gang type. Oh, no, man. What's up, y'all? What's up, CJ? What's crack? Man, all they care about is smoking and money. You can't knock the homies hustle, sweet. Them marks ain't soldiers. They idiots trying to be businessmen. Yeah, but they down with us, man. All they down with is money. CJ, go down there and show these fools you mean business. These chumps from the balls are sweating the homies. Go put pressure on them. Let's do it. We've been putting time in the hood, but we got to get the homies back together. Like the old days. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, you right. So you and Ryder go handle your business. Man, they are slang to their own mama. They don't care about nothing. You're naive, my friend. We gotta keep our focus. We need some backup. 
You seen beat up? Nah. But him and the homeboy Bear, they good to have on our side. Oh, Big Bear? Yeah, them bass slangers gonna be sorry now. Hey, beat up is only a couple of blocks away. The hood's all messed up, huh? Yeah, you try to get any of these crackheads to help you out. One of the families ain't up on it. Apart from smoke, sweet, and you know yours truly. Grove Street don't bang no more. Yeah, just get blown. For sure. How is that fair? I, I mean, I'm white, middle class, very erudite. Hey, slow down, fool. You don't even know which door it is. Whatever, man. This it? Yeah, this it right here. Open up! You sure you still live here? Fool, I told you this it. Open up! Who the fuck is it? CJ, what the fuck you want? Get the fuck out of here. Wait, hold up, man. What happened to for life, nigga? The only thing that matters is the hood, homie. But you'll never understand what getting this money is like. You know what, man? Get the fuck out of here for you be laying on your back. Big Bear, come check this fool. Hey, Bear? <coughs> Big Bear, that's you? Hey, you still from the hood, homie, nah, or what? the only thing Bear give a fuck about is smoking and keeping my house clean. Ain't that right, Big Bear? <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah what? Hell yeah, sir. Now go make that motherfucking toilet spark. Oh, no, man. Oh, man. Bear, come on. Everyone likes to party sometimes, CJ. I'll see you around. Stay the fuck from around here, punk. Hey, nigga, fuck you. Damn. This shit's fucked up. I see what you mean now, man. If Crack can do that to Big Bear, turn him into a base slave, the average motherfucker ain't got a chance. Damn dope fiends and drug addicts everywhere in the city. Piss me off. Look like it's up to us. Let's just cruise through the hood and find us somebody selling. My grandfather smoked his whole life. <laughs> and he lived until he was 32. So what I'm saying is, why can't we encourage more smoking and use the money to pay for better health care and some cultural programs? Bringing expressive dance and sun worship back to the inner cities. Worrying about the inner city has ruined... Hey, check it out. Somebody's selling to one of the homies. Hey, partner, I'm working, man. What you need? What you need, dog? Dog, I got quiet. You call man, me CJ, sure. bitch. Man, I know this cat. He a punk used to run with a front yard baller OG from Idlewood. I know his place. It's just across the tracks there. Let's check it out. Hey, ain't that front yard turf? Man, are you a buster? Nah, I'm down, homie. Go to that bat over there. Man, we on a serious mission now. Killed them all myself with my bare hands. Could I get a tax break for all this unpaid? Oh, no sweat, homie. Everybody in the hood know ballers and pussies. Then hide most of your net worth off. Man, you can smell a crack den a mile away. Yeah, let's shoot through and introduce ourselves. Afternoon, ball of dope pushers. Grove Street OGs come to do damage. Fuck them Grove Street fools. Grove Street going down. Who is it, these motherfuckers? <laughs> You hit like a girl, man. I thought you had some. Move on. So now. Now ballers know Grove Street families on their way back up. An intellectual cesspit. Ball up show, oh, homie. That was more. Grove Street you went out on flipping, man. Times change. Oh, man. They gonna be mad at us. I'll be on the gang later. For now, this is bass in the silence of big motherfuckers. Come here, fool! Should not write me any more prescriptions for painkillers. Remember, when the left wing and the right wing come together, fool! <laughs> the country can really get going. Straight off a cliff. We'll see you next time. Boy, I. Hey, give me that paper. 
Bobby and Marvin Trill broadcasting live from his trailer in the desert. A new planet found in space. Is it really a planet or a decoy put up to confuse us? Ghosts, time travel, and a flushing toilet. Which way did Newton's toilet spiral? And now that the base ain't getting pushed up in their faces, maybe these fools should be up for some real bang. Yeah, Grove gonna get back on his feet now, for sure, though. Later, homie. What's happening with you, Rodden? Respect has to be earned, sweet, just like money. So what you saying? You don't respect me? What I'm saying is, speak up, nigga. I'm hungry. Oh, man, <laughs> shit. Hey, man what's going cannot on? live on bread alone. I know. I tried that shit. Carl, you look a little thin, man. You gotta be hungry, man. Yeah, man, I what could you eat. fools trying to eat? That's what wrong. about some tacos? Tacos again? Hell no. Nah. Chicken, man. No discussion. Man, I don't want no chicken. Carl, you dry. Smoke look like he gonna pass out. In the pit. Come on, big kid. We gotta talk about it. We all gotta talk about it. They was going for sweet. How are you supposed to know that? You know what people are like. Say they have love for you, but won't say a word. Too damn scared. Some people say they saw a green saber doing the Your mama must be proud of you driving, fool. Yeah, but people like to talk, don't they? Anyway, that's half of Santos you talking about. Yeah, you right. My bad. Hey, bro. They had sprayed the house. I ain't some shit. My sister's son got to 18 and just ran away. She was brokenhearted. Now me and little Josh. Can I take your order, please? Carl, what do you want? You gotta eat to keep your strength up, man. Hey, I'll take a number nine, fat boy. Give me a number nine, just like his. Uh, let me get a number six with extra dip. I'll have two number nines, a number nine large, a number six with extra dip, a number seven, two number 45s, one with cheese, and a large soap. Hey, sorry, bro. You know I gotta know about mine. I know, CJ, I know. I'm just trying not to think about it, though. I mean, I didn't even know she was hit until it was all over. Yeah, right, 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 right. Let's eat. Hey, don't we got beef around here? We have been getting into it with these fools. I can't stand cold food. Unlike you, I ain't never ate from a trash can. <laughs> oh, shit. Trash can, bitch. Pass me my food. Hey, hey, look. Kilo Trey scoping us out. Damn, Ryder, you a jinx. Shit, the motherfuckers headed to the hood. Five, five. Move it, see Point. When the rest of the city goes on stop. Try that again. Carl, let's get back to the grove. Alright, I'm on. Oh, man. That food filled the hole. You chubby motherfucker. Next time you better start blasting, I'm gonna blast you myself. Smoke you wide, man. I mean, wide. <laughs> and that's why you love me, baby. I see Tunnel of Doom at high speed makes sense. <laughs> Yeah, I know about frigid action myself. I mean, they gotta be kidding me. Since when has running been an Olympic sport? That's one up for the grow. Say what, Smoke? All you managed to do was eat my damn food up. Yeah, it was getting cold. Y'all coming in for a beer? Nah, baby. I need to get back to the crib. CJ, give me a ride. All right, Smoke, let's go. See y'all later. <laughs> anyway, look, who's on the line? We got a Caledonians fan on the line. What was with you back there, Smoke? 
Man, if you can eat your food while everybody else is losing theirs and blaming you, you straight, home. Huh? What? Nothing. Nothing. Just some poetry I read. Hey, Smoke, tell me why you moved out the Grove. Man, got some money from my aunt. I mean, it's a nice place and all, but the Grove is in my heart. Hey, thanks, Carl. Hey, I miss having you around, baby. Thanks, man. I wish Sweet thought like that. He don't mean it, CJ. He's still real tore up about your moms, man. Here, get yourself a little smoky smoke on smoke and relax, homie. getting prepared. Shoes were going on, feet, shirts were going on, the shirt part of their body, serious faces on them. And you could tell that they were going to play this game. Bottom line is, if they don't score more points than the other team, they can't win. Yeah, man. God, you have some spooky insights into sports, dude. I love your show, man. I, I love you. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, look. Great talking to you. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hey, that's really perceptive stuff. You know, we've been petitioning stadiums to install a urinal trough in front of each row of seats. Now, it's so... Carl, it's Officer Hernandez. Who? Officer Hernandez. I work with Tenpenny and Pulaski. Oh, the bitch. What the hell you want? Hey, show me some respect, boy. Go fuck yourself. You just they bitch. You watch your tone, boy. Now listen, I've got a message from Officer Tenpenny. Don't try and leave town. That would be a big mistake. You hear me? We're watching you. Whatever you say, bitch. Give me 15, motherfucker. I'll write it down in a second. I ain't gonna pencil whip you fast, sucker. Let me play first. All right, what's up? What's up, what's man? Who winning? Who you think, huh? Me. That does it. That's game null and void, motherfuckers. So, uh, what kind of guns we working with now? One times came through, raid the spot. We ain't got shit now. Well, what you gonna do if the ballers roll through? Throw shoes at him? Say, what happened to Emmett? Emmett? <laughs> shit, gangs these days got Max, AKs, and all kind of stuff. Emmett, on the other hand, ain't got shit. Well, until we get that plug, we gotta deal with a cat that always been there for us. Emmett, Seville Boulevard families. We ain't too close these days, but nonetheless, I'll take you to see him. Get ourselves strapped up. Come on, man. Nigga, shake him up again. What happened to the fam? What a love, man. Shit happens. Seville wrongs Temple. Temple wrongs grow. Bad blood needs to bad blood. If you read the book, that's the way of the world, baby. Yeah, but you know you gotta keep it real. I admire you, Carl. You're a leader. A visionary. Remember me when you get to the top. Give it a rest, Smoke. Oh, shit. And patriotism finally come together this weekend at the All-America Trump Driving Cup. Hi from Vinewood. That's my man right there, you know what I'm saying? Hey! Who shot at me? What you kids want? Hey, hey, Pops! Hey, what's happening? Aren't you Beverly Johnson's boy? That's right. Right. Say, ain't, ain't you dead? No, nah, Emmett. The other one, Carl. I'm s sorry about Beverly. That's why we're here, sir. We want to get the people who did it. Well, you come to the right place. Try anything you like, boy. Man, look at this old shit. Die, little glass baller, fool! Oh, Beverly be so proud of you, boy! Shit, I'm the best there ever was! Yeah, that's real Grove Street style now. Cap your ass and your ass. You want some too? Ice cold, baby. I knew 
I was the chosen one. Oh man, check out Special Agent Big Smoke. Oh, you, you're making me so proud of you. Killer, baby! Ice cold! But remember something. Real strength comes from within, my brother. Listen to the boy. Yeah, I guess liberty didn't soften you none, huh? Hey, look, let's split. Hey, I'll see you around, Emmett. I'm a hundred percent behind you, boys. But remember this. You didn't get them from me. And remember this. Emmett is the place for guns. I've always got high-quality merchandise, and I've been proud of serving the community for over 30 years. <laughs> Crazy old fool. Hey, look, you drive, man. I seen Noah Cannons in this strap in the museum. We'll be going. Man, I'm real tired, dude. Drop me off in my crib, baby. Wow, that's terrible. No wonder our studios are surrounded by protests. How could anybody find that if... What's going on, man? Shit seemed pretty fucked up. People have to open their eyes and their hearts. What are you talking about? I'm talking about the children of all men's face, brother. Sometimes they seem real, but other times there's no choice at all. At least you still talking shit. You ain't changed the bit. Who, me? No, never. You know I got the money. Yeah. Don't you think you're just a little out of touch? Whoa, 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 yeah. I'm rich and I work in Vinewood, okay? I'm not out of touch. Action, weightlifting, and killing foreigners. That never goes out of style, Dex. My last film, okay, Loincloth, about a wrestler who's dropped into Thailand and I saved the world by teabagging the bad guys. That's a spiritual picture. That's love teabagging. That stuff ain't out of style. Yeah, things are more sensitive now. I was affected, all right, when Ho Chi got hurt and exploded. I mean, I, I thought it was Time to do something, a film that made a difference. But Ho Chi was a character. Exploder was a movie. Right, right, and I was there, and I should have killed them all. Don't push me, Dex. I'll give you a war you won't believe. That look in your eye, right here, right now. Thanks, CJ. I see your wrath. Let us smoke. Speak. I thought you was representing. What? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I thought you was rolling with Grove Street again. Already told you I am. Well, I ain't seen you in your colors yet. You gotta fly the flag, man. Ain't nobody gonna respect you if you ain't representing your hood. All right, man. My bad. I just ain't got around to it yet. There's a Vico around the corner from the gym and gas. Go get yourself some green. That's right, you stop. Come on, they haven't shrunk. Touch them. Feel them. No. Come on, sniff them. Do something. No. Touch them. Touch them or die. They're still big. They're huge, That's Jack. That's right. Your mom, Easy. Hey, don't grab them like that. Oh, boy, I was kidding. What are you, a boyfriend of mine or something? Hey, hey, hey. hey. You had me scared there for a minute. I, 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 I crapped myself. Take it easy. It's not even loaded. Come in. Try on.
I'm trying to start a band. Do come again, sir. told WCTR the real problem with drugs. They always say there's too many drugs in the hood. Homie, that's bullshit. Plain bullshit. I mean, the way I see it is, it ain't enough drugs in the hood. Ain't nothing like enough, and that's the real problem for people. Police still have no leads in the tragic murder of Officer Ralph Pendlebury, whose body was found recently. Pendlebury worked... Hey, what's going on, man? Yeah. Hey, CJ, it's sweet. Hey, what's up? If you don't respect your body, ain't nobody gonna respect you. You're too skinny, CJ. You need to pack on some muscle. If I wanted nagging, I'd buy a clockwork wife. Just looking out for you, homie. It's all show and respect, you know. <laughs> yeah, I guess. There's a gym I go to a couple blocks out from the Grove. Go check it out and get yourself a gangster physique. I'll scope it out. <laughs> Later, man. Santos is cold in a motherfucker. I love violence. I could drive as well as CJ, man, I'm telling you. <laughs> yeah. Hey, homie, what's up? Hey, what you saying about me, fool? What's up, man? I'm saying that the East Coast made you drive like an idiot, fool. Man, you always crashing cars and shit. And for some reason, now you back. All it is is CJ dry here, CJ dry there. Bullshit. Man, why don't you just take it easy? No disrespect, man, but you can't drive for shit. Thanks, man. Nah, 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 say what you really mean. You such a good government, homie. You gotta ride shotgun. Show CJ what's cracking. Hey, you know something? You right. Yeah, CJ, you can drive, homie. He's tripping. Where we going, homie? Rolling Heights, Ballers Country. Do us a little drive-by, huh? You know something, matter of fact? You are show fun for this little gig. Come on. G, thanks, G. Just don't draw like no fool. Enormous man, no taste of what the German's worst. The world is full of incredible things, and you can discover them for yourself. Come along, I'll take you there. Yeah, ball is turned. You dog ready? Yeah, for sure, I'm ready. Carl, just concentrate on the driving, and we'll take care of the shoot. Listen to the man, fool, and try not to park us up a tree or something. Yeah, if the car stops, we dead meat. War is folly, and we can only unite by visiting these epochs of culture. When a man can be himself, smoke cigarettes, dress in gladiator clothing if he likes. We mustn't force our way and culture upon other people's. Others, become part of it. Maybe Hemingway was right about love. Maybe Floyd was. Fuck you up. They're all fighting inside to let a wild creature mate in the rain. I travel, therefore I am. This is we'll ice them, CJ. Let's hunt down some more. Get Move us the hell out of here. Carl, don't run out on me again. Yeah, the the road. Let's roll. It's a blizzard of excitement. And she... The rails are great and long. <laughs> Bolivia's not bad either. Or Peru. You'll be surprised to find out how the party never stops. Have the food. That was way too easy. Let's go blast on some more ball of food. There's scarcely time to eat, my boy. You'll meet fascinating people. Feel... Oh, CJ. What is you doing? CJ! Hey, Carl, don't run out on me again. <laughs> Let's roll! The city. This is such a great country. Why would you go anywhere else? 
It's unpatriotic to travel. I mean, I got more salmon and the price. What are you waiting for, CJ? Find us some more ballers so we can count. You're a rail after college. They'll come back with ludicrous misconceptions about healthcare, charity, and civilization. Europe is not the real world. Here, well, I love to slum about in a dirty youth hostel with communal showers as much as the next man. Sometimes more. But I have to agree, Europe is overrated. Eastern Europe was good for a few years after the war came down, but even there, the police are too strict. You just... Damn, man, move! Move! Unexplored pleasures to be had in the Far East. Smash on the car, smash! Hey, I've been listening to you go on and on about traveling. Do you know how expensive it is to fly to Asia? Russia saw the light. They're all coming here to set up crime families and run numbers. South America, everyone went extinct there. They have less culture there than the content of my toilet bowl. Rainforest, schmain forest. And Mexico, if I wanted to be that close to my ancient ancestors, I'd be banging my mother-in-law instead of my wife's best friend. Look, we can fight like beasts or agree to disagree. I'm sure the summit of your aspirations in life is a cheerleader with fake guns, but some of us think a little more exotically than this. Next caller, vamos, buenos dias and noches. If you don't smile, I won't deep. Harder! Oh, sorry, got lost for a second. Speak. Hey, I love this show. I'm a huge fan. I visit all the places you've recommended, and in a lot of them, they're still talking about you. I even saw posters of you in the customs booth at the airport. Yeah, Grove is back, man. Grove is back. Yeah, for sure. They were slipping, man. Man, I'm shocked you didn't get us killed, CJ. Let me check myself. Hey, Carl, hey, ignore hey, hey, that motherfucker. You did good today. Awesome, I can't wait. Anybody Thanks, man. Right? Yes, we all love to travel, get away from it all, get away from the people with computers and their databases, the police harassing you for doing... We're down with the Grove and the ball is over. So watch yourself for now on, CJ. Yeah, yeah, for sure. You know that. I'll see y'all later. Here, take this. Go get yourself some beers. I was teaching them how to swim. I have a lot of experience with this. I want you to stop for a moment and let me read from my travel journal. I think everyone should keep a journal. Paste pictures, notes. Sometimes people object to you taking their picture, but a few pennies of their local currency and they will fawn over you. Some people think this is patronizing, but I think it is fair enough. They need the money and I need the company. Besides which, it is the oldest... Jeffrey's been somebody bit for the past three weeks, right? <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah. Hey. hey. What's up, CJ? CJ? What's up? What's up, man? Want to go to prison? What? <laughs> nah. Pick up Jeffrey. He's touching down today. You want to roll? Yeah, for sure. What Jeffrey doing locked up anyway? We'll talk about that later, man. Let's roll. We're late. Jail for for his career, joy ride, parking fines, and some other bullshit. Youth counselors in Los Santos are heading to the streets and meeting one on one with members of the community. One citizen told WCTR the real oh, problem of drugs. Boy. They always say there's too many drugs in the hood, homie. That's bullshit, plain bullshit. I mean, way I see it is, it ain't enough drugs in the hood. Ain't nothing like enough, and that's the real problem for people. Police still have no lead. Hey, there that fool go. Look at this fool, man. Perk Trey like he banging. Think he hard. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> oh, I tell you. I know that fool can't be serious. Hey, what's happening with you, Jeffrey? Hey, man, it's OG Loke, homie. OG Loke! Ah, ah, my bad. How was it, though, homie? 
Man, what you think? How was it? Hey, chill out, dude. So what you want to do now? Man, I got to kill some Chola motherfucker. He was dissing me, man. Hey, Jeff. I thought you was going to, uh, college. <laughs> <laughs> man, fuck you. Motherfucker done stole my rhymes. He's in East Flores. Hey, give me a strap. Man, won't you stalls out with that shit to get in the car? Fool. What's your plan, big gangster? Now you a free man and all. Man, I ain't free. I'm gonna roll over to line me up with a job. Motherfucker always trying to keep a player down. You got that right. Still, ain't so bad. I'm gonna be a hygiene technician. Coming up in the world, huh? Just a stepping stone to greatness. Okay. Jenny on the line from Santa Maria. Hi, Jenny. How's your heart? Broken. Like my arm and two of my ribs. What happened? I married my childhood sweetheart, but it all went wrong. He's become a drunk, and he has a substance problem, too. And now he beats me every day. Stay with him, honey. After all, you're only lonely when you're alone. But he keeps threatening to kill me. Jenny, do you know the meaning of the phrase homewrecker? No. What about selfish bitch? I want to bring people together, not break them apart. Who's on the phone? It's a big, lonely state out there. Keep on, Mary. I'm watching you right now in the shower. Notice how many lonely hearts are lunatics? You wonder why? Man, this is the spot. Ain't this Vargo's hood? Man, I don't give a shit. I'm gangsta. <laughs> Come on, let's leave Loke to deal with Casanova. Hey, I'll stick with Jeff. I mean, Loke. Okay, cool. I'll see you guys back on the set. You want something? I'm looking for don't upset me. Freddy, I'll come for you, you motherfucker! Hey, Lo, hold up! Jeffrey, you got the wrong idea, man. That was just a prison thing. I, I got plenty of muchachas on the outside. I don't need your scrawny ass. Man, ignore him. CJ, I don't know what he talking about. Hey, yo, give me back my rhymes, you thief. I'm gangster. You dropped the soap, sugar. I don't know nothing about any rhymes. Hey, hey, motherfuckers making a run for it. Hey, Lo, get back here, nigga, you crazy. Hey, yo, back off me, CJ. I gotta protect my rep. I can help out some of y'all clients, you know. Ooh, chase me, chase me. The pleasure dome's cooked. Anybody that's out there lonely, first of all, with all the people on this planet walking around, there's no reason for anybody to be lonely. You understand? That's why I'm in the business of keeping people with company. You know what I'm saying? So people who got low self-esteem and they need to pick me up, they need oh to come my. down. Come on, honey, I'm losing my patience. And this goes for everybody. I don't care who you are, how old you are. So come on down and hang out with me if you're lonely. And I'm going to tell you something. You won't be lonely from the moment you walk in the door because somebody's going to grab your hand and it's going to be all about to get down from that Good moment. grief. That's not the way lonely hearts works at all. Is anyone here suffering? I'm... I like the fast ass, not the slow ass. Hi, this is Tamara. I'm a stalker. Uh... That's really beautiful. Tell everyone about it. My man, well, I call him that, even though he's broken off all contact and is married to someone else. I killed the gazelle and sent its heart to him in an... I thought you were king, you fun. Newspapers. Then I burnt down his place of business, and now I have a special surprise for him. Ah, oh, you have a great week. Isn't that really beautiful? <laughs> Give me that money. Catch me if you can. Until next time. I hope you enjoyed Lonely Hearts. It's always fun to laugh at other people's misery, isn't it? Hello? Oh, uh, hey, it's me, Jonathan. I, I don't know a Jonathan. Yeah, that's the name they gave me at the orphanage after you put me up for adoption. How could you give me away? Bring the family together again. San Andreas Telephone for those difficult conversations. If you love to hear liberals whine and conservatives lecture, then stay tuned for I Say You Say. The future of America, threatened again. This time we mean it. I'm Dr. Phillips. And I'm also Dr. Phillips. Today on the show, do cave paintings in museums make us violent? The anti-beef movement. Both Hitler and Mussolini were vegetarian. And we take on the highly charged debate about test tube babies and actually talk to one. 
I have flashbacks and go into hysterics in science class. Do you know what it's like growing up in a beaker? That's all today on I Say, You Say. We share last names, but that's about it. I'm Peyton, that's my wife Mary, and this... Ooh, or we're east meets west, and the west always wins. That wall came down, darling. Yes, unfortunately it did. I, I don't know if you saw today's news, so who is in the right in this great dialectical disaster? Is it, as I think, a case of share and share alike? Love your fellow man and all wear matching jumpsuits while working on the collective hydroponic farm growing potatoes? Or kill or be killed, crush the weak, and starve the poor, as my wonderful wife thinks. You decide, or let us decide for you. Give us a call, and... You know I love the thrill of a chase. Anthropology, work things out. That's the problem with liberals. They don't know when to shut up and enjoy free. Hey, baby, you go Nobody wants to hire somebody funny. I, I mean, how is that fair? I, I mean, I'm white, middle class, very erudite. Um, you know, whatever that means. Gotta show a little bit more enthusiasm, Barney. Are you related to my husband? <laughs> Uh, <clears throat> uh, I, I don't think so. I hope not. Have you got a question about politics? Yeah, sure. I know a lot about politics. Hey, can I do your job? You know, I used to be on the radio back in the day. Even my husband can't do his job, you strange with that little slap. <laughs> Lonely low. Hey, I like a nice mustache myself. I keep it real. I like you fake ass motherfuckers. Come on, gangster. Let's get back to the grove. No, I can't. I gotta go and sign in for this damn job. Whatever you want. You wanna ride anyway? Sure thing. Let's roll. Hey, take me to the burger shot in Marola Beach. You're the boss. Cause I'm keen with the hygiene on a mission like a super technician, baby. This ain't no big deal, I just want the core. Ended by what you're saying. I'm a smoker. Get on with this shit, man. Look at you. Oh, muscle shit. Man, I got 17s on that hand. You could've did that out here. Because I did it in the joint? It's real now. Yeah, I guess it is. Gangster. Smokers pay more taxes than anyone. My grandfather smoked his whole life. <laughs> He lived until he was 32. So what I'm saying is, why can't we encourage more smoking and use the money to pay for better health care and some cultural programs, bringing expressive dance and sun worship back to the inner cities? Worrying about the inner city has ruined your academic career. And this woolly thinking is going to ruin your chances of getting anywhere with me tonight. The thing is, smoking is good because it lets people make a lot of money, but so is selectively culling the population. So what I'm proposing is a change in the proposition. Let people smoke, but make cigarettes much cheaper and force everyone to smoke. That way we weed out the weak, make a lot of money in tax, and keep our national heritage intact. Line two, you're on I Say, You Say. Ha! Ah, I listen every time to your show. It really made me think about the world a whole new way. I moved out of the city because it sucks. Now I live in a compound surrounded by barbed wire and shoot and kill anyone I don't recognize on my land. Just want to say thank you. That's quality broadcasting. Yeah, thanks. That makes me feel a lot better about myself. Have you got a question? Yeah, I got corpses from 15 illegal immigrants in my yard. I killed them all myself with my bare hands. Which delicious meal would Sir like? Again, sir. Please enjoy your meal. Have a wonderful day. Glamorous mm -hmm. with your long hair and big ideas. You are studying for a PhD in cultural ceramic history mm -hmm. or cross cultural. Uh Thanks for the ride, CJ. Don't be a stranger, fool. Yeah, for sure. I'll see you around. Like a quarter pound. Later. Ooh. 
trip, wrapped in neuroses and completely unable to function. Looking real technical, gangster. <laughs> you ain't run off again yet? No, gangster. I'm here for good. Yeah? Well, fuck this gig, man. I'm putting together a listening party for my album. But first, I need a sound system. Hey, I'm down as long as I don't have to go to the port. What you talking about, fool? Guaranteed I start playing, everybody will come through. Being real OG, I really ain't into rap no more. I'm more into that hardcore gangster shit. Well, that's me, homie. That's me, OG Loke, baby. Yeah, yeah, for sure. But I only like them if they rhyme real well. You know, well, anyway, what you want me to steal? That's what I'm talking about. Love for your homies. Now check it. I caught me a real fly sound system. Cruising through the drive through I think they headed down to the beach for a beach party. Now check this out. I roll with you, and on the way, I can get a couple of free stabs. It's OG Loke in the place. You don't want to stop me with a gun in your face. Yeah, 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 OG, yeah, man. Look, OG. shut the fuck up. Maybe I need to do this on my own. I believe in you. Gangster for life, homie. For life. Yeah, for life, homie. including several species of bird. Think about the military applications. Hello, caller. Hi, my name's Emmanuel. I'm really worried about hackers sending a nuclear bomb after me, you know, through the phone. Do you think they could pinpoint my location? Look, it's good for the economy to live in constant fear. I mean, the phone company, they have your name on the bill. They know your number. How do you feel about that? I knew it. Hello, Julie from Liberty City. You're on the line. A cowboy ghost has been haunting my house! I want you to take off your blouse. Stand at the window. Stand there for hours each night. Lure him in. Trapping rogue spirits is dangerous work, especially topless. Take lots of photographs. All right, who's got a theory for me? Next! Hey, man, love the show. What are you guys going to start seeing the bigger picture? We're being lied to, man. And guys like you don't help much, you know? You're virtually one of them. Soon you'll know what I'm...
the way. Let me take you into my office. Advice, Marie. Feeling it down. Charging with Maurice. Only on WCTR. Let's be honest about things for a second. Really honest. You came out to the West Coast to get away from something. Everyone does. Let's face it, the Midwest is full of retards. That's why we've got the fastest growing population, a massive economy, and absolutely no history or culture. You used to be a dork, but you moved here, and suddenly you're cool. San Andreas is a land where you can be who you want to be. Change your name, come out, lie about your age, form your own religion, call yourself an actor with wait tables. It just doesn't matter out here. Everybody's at it, until the awful moment old friends or family come to visit Janice understands maybe it's time to change your identity don't let bad memories blow your cover we'll teach you all the things you need to alienate your family quick they'll never think of visiting you again select from a list of weird religions that involve burning things singing children's songs backwards and loads of television worship we'll select a member of another race or life form for you to claim as your soulmate and your dietary habits will go Pacific too people come to San Andreas to escape their past we'll help you lose contact with friends and family fast Janice it's time to invent the new you. Up next on WCTR, it's the man coaches hate. It's Derek Thackeray in the tight end zone. Brought to you by Eris Pump Up Shoes. Because women love a winner, and winners wear shoes. Should we uh, start with the national anthem? GSF needs your core. Drug scandals involving preschool soccer moms. <laughs> and the national finals, rich and popular people are fighting it out. Pay attention, the country is in mourning. And most importantly, sports wear. We talked to a fitness expert about the crucial role of endorsed clothing. And who could forget, we visit the greatest moment. He's in the shadows. There he is. Is he going to make it? Yes, he did. Ladies and gentlemen, what you have just witnessed. Boom. Asshole. Yo, Carl, see you around. <laughs> Fuck they doing over here anyway. Punk ass police. Those nosy motherfuckers won't leave me alone. I think I'm Mr. Big or something, but I don't tell him shit. For me, it's all about my homeboy Carl. Yeah, whatever you say. The game is real important, CJ, you know that. You down to represent, baby? Yeah. Look, my cousin is coming in town from Mexico. I gots to go scoop her up. All right, then, come on. Jerry Gerbil, the kids have someone. What you want me to roll with you for anyway? No reason. I just wanted to get in the car, boot lane. Oh, yeah. Yeah, man, just cool out, homie. Just chill. Your cousin coming here from Mexico. Yeah, me and her go way back. Way back. Ah, smoke good full of shit. Don't be prejudiced again in my presence, Carl. Everybody is my cousin. Sports have mattered. Football, baseball, and killing communists. And uh, I had a great childhood. Really great, even if my uncle did kill Okay. My cousin Mary's in there. Sweet, sticky, bud fresh off the plantation. Here, pull up here. Let me do the talk. Man, I should have known. Hey! Excuse me, Jose. Yo soy el grando smokio. And I want that grass, comprende? <laughs> hey, fuck you, cabrón. What? Now that ain't nice. Coffee-o up El Wido before I blow your brains out all over the patio. Chinga tu madre, pendejo. Oh, 
man then better he fuck this man fuck this get him smoke yeah, yeah. get this shit back get what you talk about yeah fuck a big smoke remember that name we got to stick with him man i'm done Ah, come on, pay me. I'm a career criminal. <laughs> you getting jacked. Boom! I'm a big fire fan. Love a bit of a punch up. Since my wife and children are taken into the shelter, my friend said, Chuck. You obviously love hitting things, so I've gotten in the box. How about that fight between Gonzalez and Jack? Hey, there's too much money at stake for one thing. I mean, these guys got too much to lose. I mean, why is a guy gonna take a dive for a few extra million when he could earn that over a number of years getting his brain turned to pulp? Be serious for a minute. The clock is counting down again. It's time for Derek to head in the locker room and celebrate in the shower. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bring a cooler full of beers and get ready to riot. This has been the Tight End Zone. And this is WCTR, proving that radio is better than TV. That's the show men with large guts love. Coming up next, the most mind-numbing thing since the lobotomy, Entertaining America. This week on Entertaining America, Richard Goblin, one man's triumphant return to cock. The Sherman Octuplets, a Venturist man says he's slept with them all. Plus, noise, speed, danger, cursing, and patriotism finally come together this weekend at the All-America Drunk Driving Cup. Hi from Vinewood, you're on Entertaining America with me, Billy Dexter, bringing you everything that is important in culture and entertainment, if there is a difference between the two, from the heart of entertainment in America, Vinewood San Andreas. Hey, Carl. Keeping busy, I hope. You know me, Officer Ten Penny. Yeah, I know you, Carl. I know everything about you. Don't touch me, you pig hands. That's right, Carl. I got my eye on you. And? Like I give a fuck. We're watching you, Carl. Motherfucker! What was that all about, baby? You tell me. Oh, hell, man. They got their nose in everything. Can't shit without Tim Penny taking an interest. The hell with him. Yeah, I guess. What's really up? Ain't thinking of taking a little ride. Three deep mention a little something that might put us deeper in the game. All right, I'm down. Where to, Small? Unity Station. Of zero seconds to death Thank time you, day. thank you. But many say your new film has gone too far. No, this is a romantic comedy with drama. It's got action. It's got a heart. That's what's most important, I think. Okay, well, let's take a listen to the trailer. All right, let's roll that. He was a man at war with himself, fighting a war that someone else... What are we looking for, Smoke? Some Vargas cats meeting some San Fierro reef, cutting some kind of deal. San Fierro? I thought Northern Mexicans don't mix with Los Santos S.A. Shit, you got me. That look like them. Motherfuckers, clock!
We gotta get those fools! has been running Peruvian flake! Follow that train! And I'm gonna find it! No juice! Get me close, DJ! I'm about to pop these boots! He becomes one of them. What is this? That's teachers! Roll up on him, DJ, so I can get a shot! Oh, you got it! Shot yourself! Way to go! <laughs> he was finally beginning to live a normal life. Then, all hell breaks loose. Tim, you're so stupid! You count with your fingers! You want party with me? Bring it on! Tim, what are you doing? I fought for my country! Welcome to the land of freedom, bitches! Yeah! Special needs cop. He had a lot to learn. This film cannot be rated. Wow, that's terrible! No wonder our studios are surrounded by protests. How could anybody find that effect? Makes me physically sick. And the idea of you calling someone slow-witted is, frankly... Hold on, hold on. Drugs are example. a problem throughout all of society. I fight them by any means necessary. Yeah, but you use drugs. No, no, no. I'd rather die than use drugs. I use steroids and some recreational blow. But I got the funds for it. You know, I got the money. Yeah, don't you make the high road on the right I'm rich and I work in Vinewood, okay? I'm not out of touch. Action, weightlifting, and killing foreigners. That never goes out of style, Dex. My last film, okay, Loincloth, about a wrestler who's dropped into Thailand, and I say, uh, the fuck out the train. That's love, t -bagging. That stuff ain't out of style. Yeah, things are more sensitive now. I was affected, all right, when Ho Chi got hurt and exploded. Oh, that man, I'm a high oh, right. difference. Yeah, but Ho Chi was a character. Exploder was a movie. Right. Right, and I was there, and I should have killed them all. Don't push me there. Hey, let's get out of here before the cops show that. Right now. Okay, oh, uh, uh, Jack, Jack. Uh, all I'm saying is, you launching missiles from a special wheelchair. And was it always like this? Was what always like this? Always fucked up around here? Or is it because of the drugs? What you think, man? I don't know. That's why I'm asking you. Yo, hey, hey, don't ask a wise man, Frank. Ask a fool. That's what I was. Well, if you're gonna make this day personal, I ain't speaking on it no more. Oh, but you're Billy Dexter! Who put you up to this? Go! The gun down! My balls? Please! I I'm sure you have huge ones. That's right! Please stop! Come on, they haven't shrunk. Touch them! Feel them! No! Come on, no. sniff them! Do something! No. Touch them! Touch them or die! Oh, yeah. They're still yeah. big! Oh, God. They're huge, That's Jack. right. Yeah, yeah. Mom, Easy, hey. Don't grab them like that. Oh, boy, I was kidding. What are you, a boyfriend of mine or something? Hey, hey, hey. I had me scared there for a minute. I, <laughs> I, I, I crapped myself. Take it easy. It's not even loaded. Oh, oh, Dex. Oh, shit. Oh, well, I guess it was. Oh, okay, Billy, don't get around. Get up, boy. Get up, come on. Damn it, his brain is leaking. Help! Oh, there's only one thing to do. I gotta defend freedom! No time to cry! Only time to die! Welcome to the land of freedom, bitches! Oh! That was Entertaining America, showing you why America is so respected culturally across the world. All the news the government wants you to hear. WCTR. Hey, Mom, watch! No hands! I just lost control of my bike and crashed. Only skinned my knee a little bit. Nothing too bad. Jesus H. Christ! My little baby! That's it! No more bike riding for you! Not today! Not ever! Mom, it doesn't hurt too bad! I love my bike! I just fell. It happens. That's it! I'm getting you a car! Wow! Cool! I did not bring you into this world in order for you to be exposed to anything dangerous. I lost my figure for you. I ruined your father's life with my nagging. I will not see you die on some outdated contraption. I won't! I won't! I won't! I will protect you in any way I can. It's a mother's duty. I love you, Mom. Well, you need a car. Will we mortgage the house or do whatever it takes? I want you safe. And what better protection than an overpowered sports poop you can drive when first experimenting with drinking and drugs? The teenage years can be difficult and dangerous. 
better clear out, CJ. I don't want those crash fools trying to pull you into some shit. All right, homie. You be careful with those cats. I'm gonna see you later. Out the whip, fool. Oof. Come along. I'll take you there. It was dusk, and the sun bled red over the city in Thailand as Chen brought me a sparkling water. A delicate, handsome, lovely young boy. The world was about to But war is folly, and we can only unite by visiting these epochs of culture, where a man can be himself, smoke cigarettes, dress in gladiator clothing if he likes. We mustn't force our way and culture upon other peoples. Rather, breathe it in. Become part of it. Maybe Hemingway was right about love. Maybe Freud was. We're all fighting inside to let a wife. Sweet! Smoke! Shit, where all the homies at? Fuck they had. Damn. Fuck it. Hey. Carl, no time to chit chat. Been seeing a Seville family beer, work out on the street, and the boys don't like it. I'm pinned down in Seville hood, and we need a ride out of here. Pronto. Oh, for sure, man. Hang in there. Drop by image and get heated. Hey, careful, homie. Move, dude. Let me drive for you. Oops. I call it the three G's. You just grab, get in, and go. You shut up, bitch. Yeah, you be quiet, bitch. This is a news story. Oh, cool. This is great. This is quality journalism. Uh, back to you, Leanne. Hey, let's get blunted and grab some clucky bell. I have got mad munchies. Sounds good to me. Fire it up. Youth counselors in Los Santos are heading to the streets and meeting one-on-one -on -one with members of the community. One citizen told WCTR the real problem with drugs. They always say there's too many drugs in the hood. Homie, that's bullshit. Plain bullshit. I mean, the way I see it is, it ain't enough. I see you inside, baby. Man, this set tripping is killing the family. You did good back there. Hey, I'm a Johnson boy. 
Hey, I got unfinished business. Big love. Heart. Who's on the phone? It's a big lonely state out there. Careful, Mom. Um... I'm tired of you not listening to me, girl. And I'm tired of you acting like you own me. I can see who I want to see. It just ain't right you seeing some cello motherfucker. Oh, what? A no good, narrow minded, hypocrite gangbanger telling me what is right and what is wrong? Let me guess, sweet. Sisless killing right, but a boyfriend from the south side wrong? Some things ain't just meant to happen. I mean, what if y'all have kids? Leroy Hernandez? That don't sound His good, girl. His name ain't Hernandez. Well, Leroy Lopez is. Leroy Lopez either, you racist fuck. That ain't how moms raised us. I ain't racist. I just know how they feel about you. And look at you. You dress like a hooker. Oh, and I guess you two would know what a hooker look like, huh? You say it like it's a bad thing. Shut, Shut up, up, Carl. Carl. I'm just trying to protect you. For what? So I can date one of your mindless friends? I don't think so. Don't say a word, Carl. Just follow your sister before you see another dead sibling. Then you know exactly what my problem is. She's meeting him at some cholo car club. Another than Jizzy, the proprietor of the Pleasure Domes Club. If anybody is out there lonely, first of all, with all the people on this planet walking around, there's no reason for anybody to be lonely. You understand? That's why I'm in the business of keeping people with company. You know what I'm saying? People who got low self-esteem and they need to pick me up, they need to come down to the Pleasure Dome, hang out with me, Jizzy, and my girls. You know what I'm saying? They gonna keep you company, have you feeling good. And this goes for everybody. I don't care who you are, how old you are. So come on down and hang out with me if you're lonely. And I'm gonna tell you something. You won't be lonely from the moment you walk in the door because somebody's gonna grab your hand and it's gonna be all about to get there. Good grief, that's not the way Lonely Hearts works at all. Is anyone here? So you must be Sweet's bro, huh? He phoned ahead, said you might be looking for a car that bounces. Well, I owe him big from way back. So here, this should do the trick. Custom Spring should see you hopping all the way home. Try her out. Very popular with the essays. They compete in these things. You can usually find them over by Unity Station. If you ever want to mod your ride, come back anytime, man. I'm the Godfather. Liberals whine and conservatives lecture. Then stay tuned for I Say You Say. The future of America threatened again. This time we mean it. I'm Dr. Phillips. And I'm also Dr. Phillips. Today on the show, do cave paintings in museums make us violent? The anti-beef movement. Both Hitler and Mussolini were vegetarians. And we take on the highly charged debate about test tube babies and actually talk to one. I have flashbacks. I'm going to hysterics in science class. Do you know what it's like growing up in a beaker? I say, you say. We share last names, but that's about it. I'm Peyton, that's my wife Mary, and this is a great dialectical disaster. Is it, as I think, a case of share and share alike? Have your fellow man and all wear matching jumpsuits while working on a fork of on farm going to potatoes? Or kill or be killed, crush the weak, and starve the poor, as my wonderful wife thinks. You decide, or let us decide for you. Give us a call and let my wife, a professor in social Darwinism, or me, a lecturer in pointless anthropology, work things out. That's the problem with liberals. They don't know when to shut up and enjoy freedom. Let's go to the phones. Uh, yeah, hi. Here's the deal. I'm really funny, but nobody wants to hire somebody funny. I, I mean, how is that fair? I, I mean, I'm white, middle class, very erudite. Um, you know, whatever that means. But people just respond badly to me. I, I don't understand it. Are you related to my husband? <laughs> uh, <clears throat> uh, I, I don't think so. I hope not. Have you got a question about politics? 
Yeah, sure. I know a lot about politics. Hey, can I do your job? You know, I used to be on the radio back in the day. Even my husband can't do his job, you strange, pathetic little sap. <laughs> Let's have a real caller, please. Hi, my name's Michelle. I'm a first-time caller to the show. I wanted to know what you guys thought about the proposition to ban smoking. Well, this is a simple issue. Smoking. Democracy at work again. Pretty good for a beginner, eh? That shit was all right! Ah! So since when has my brother been a low rider? Since we told me to keep an eye on you. Make sure that whatever you dating don't get you in no trouble. Gionda! Nice hot being Holmes. Well, you just shook that whatever's hand. Come here, baby girl. Hey, get your dirty hands off my oh, sister. what is wrong with you? Holmes, you're acting like she's your woman, eh? She's with me, cabron. So chill the fuck out. I treat her good. Look, baby, don't start no shit. Don't make it worse. Orale, vato. Okay? Who's this pendejo? What? Dickhead? This dickhead is my brother. Easy, Holmes. He ain't from nowhere. He's cool. Well, I say he ain't cool, Holmes. I say he thinks he's gangster, man. And I don't like it. So you know what you can do for me, man? You can fuck off, pendejo, and then maybe we cool. No, you fuck off. I'm talking to my sister. Carl! Jose, come on, Holmes. I can handle this. This is important to me. Pendejo, you lucky. That's right. You lucky, sister spoken for you. Vámonos, muchachos. Let's get some fucking beer, huh? I'm thirsty. Carl, what the hell were you thinking? Look, baby. Go get in the car, okay? I'm gonna speak to Carl. Look, Holmes. I love your sister. I honor her. She's my girl for life. This is why I stopped you from being skinned just then. You got a problem with me? Fine. We don't have to be friends. But Kendall, she's happy with me, carnal. Yeah, okay. I guess we cool. For now. Cesar Villalpando. Carl Johnson. CJ. God, Ron, you got a nice ride there, Holmes. Maybe we'll get to kick it again soon, eh? Yeah, maybe. Just 
witnessed is the biggest moment in world history. Who cares about a declaration of independence or discovery of penicillin? You have just seen one man score a point. When the rest of the world discovers TV, they'll be able to see this. Wow, isn't that amazing? He did what he was paid to do. We love sports more than another load it. Let's talk about it. Stay in the tight. And Let's go to the phones. Yeah, the Wolves. Hey, Derek, my name's Jason, and I'm a Wolves fan. First time caller. I don't vote, I can't be bothered. But I will kick your ass if you disrespect my sports team. <laughs> okay, the Wolves, that's team playing sports as if they cared. Yeah, the Wolves. I don't care who's sleeping with who on the team. Yeah, I'm with you, buddy, okay. Hey, let's take another call. Who's on the phone? Hello, caller, you're on with the tight end of radio. Hey, I'm a big Olympics fan. Always have been, since day one. Been to every one. Me too. I love the games, especially the luge. Ah, I'm married, so uh, sliding down an icy tunnel of doom at high speed makes sense. <laughs> yeah, I know about it. Hey, who was this? What's up, homie? It's Cesar Villalpando, cabrón. Que onda? You seen Kendall? Yeah, she's a ramp at Amira. I was just hitting you up to say that you drive good. And you like cars, eh? So, uh... Yeah, I guess. We'll be going with this. Well, you want to make something, a little money? Does the Pope shit in the woods? I don't know, but if you do want a little extra, there's plenty of money to be made racing. You talking illegal street racing? Hell yeah! No hoopties, homes, just low riders. Nice ones. It gotta be nice if you don't get in, eh? Okay, I'm in. When and where? Drop by the spot near Corona. I'll take you to the meet. Vouch for you. These guys... These guys can be very nervous with the new racers, eh? score some points, and get some yardage, and win the game. Yeah, if they don't win, men will be beating their wives with good reason. Hey, they got to start playing to win, trying to score some on the other team. I wish I had a wife so she could beat me. <laughs> Here's what I say, man. If you want to be number one, you've got to go for first Place. I know, I know. Hey, I mean, uh, you know, it's great stating the obvious, but once you get paid for it, things get really complicated. Man, I was at their training camp this spring, and the mood in the locker room, dude, guys were getting changed, man. I mean, they were really getting prepared. Shoes were going on, feet, shirts were going on, the shirt part of their body, serious faces on them, and you could tell that they were going to play this game. Bottom line is, if they don't score more points than the other team, they can't win! Yeah, man. God, you have some spooky insights into sports, dude. I love your show, man. I, I love you. <coughs> hey. Row of seats! Now, it's so inconvenient having to leave... the time we can barely walk anyway, all right? So we'll be handing out petitions that say support. Damn. Damn. What you doing? Digging graves? Damn, where the fuck I put it, man? Put what, nigga? Man, the fucking water. Need a little something before I go deal with things. What things, fool? My homie LB, he told me about this army motherfucker who got all the guns we need. Not that old school Emmy bullshit, neither. I'm down. Let's roll. Jill, you always down, homie. Apart from when you ain't around here. Nigga, fuck you. Damn. Man, you want some of this? Nah, man. I'm cool on that. Where we going? This tilt overlooking East Beach. Better yet, you better wait until it's dark. Catch the motherfucker while he in bed. Yeah, I'm feeling that. Yeah, yeah, that's it. That's it. Come on, nigga. What you waiting for? Let it go. Look? Get in, fool. Where is this old motherfucker? When the hell is he? 
from Max, man. We ain't there yet. Yeah, right, Carl. You always right. That's my homie, Mr. Right. Shut up. You can't stop me. Who can't? Whatever. And finally, our women made from sand. We explore deeper and get to the truth. I'm Marvin Trill. This is Area 53. Hello. You're on the line. Yeah, hi. I'm a truck driver and listen to your show all the time. I see a lot of unexplained phenomena out there, especially in restrooms. I agree with you about the moon. We never landed on the moon. It's such a good fake. Remember, the Russians, our arch enemy still, I might add, them and the Australians and uh, some species of dog, they beat us into space. The only thing the Russians are shooting into space are hot dogs and monkeys. Kind of a Noah's Ark fast food kind of vibe. Hey, my dead aunt could make a better space station than them. Mm, intriguing. I'd like to meet her. On the conspiracy line, caller, you're in Area 53. Do not use fluoride. It's evil. It made me kill my doctor. Why would we worry about a chemical that the government... Let's storm the place. Hold up. Let's creep in, grab the guns, and bounce out. Gee, gee, I got it ninja style. Right. Come out, you old bastard. Shut up. He can't stop me, you buster car! Okay, fool, in you go. I'll keep watch. Keep it coming, CJ. Tell y'all, he making a killing. a natural housebreaker, homie.
plenty more in there, homie. Let's get up out of here. In the game of checkers in life, sometimes you make the wrong move and get jumped. If you made the wrong move and need money fast, we're here to capitalize on that. Some people are destined to make the wrong move. All right, now I'm straight. LB got a storage garage down in Seville Boulevard, family turf we could use. I'm on it. Seriously, Ryder, man. You gotta give up them sticks. What? Man, I give up the water if you give up being a buster. Hold it right there, homie. Buster? Forget it. Forget you, fool. One day, you gonna wish you hadn't pissed me off. Did I hear something? You sound like the buster complaining again. Man, this is childish. And I ain't talking to you no more, fool. Goods for money. We'll buy anything, including your dignity. A Vigo brokerage and pawn. Coming up next, the most mind-numbing thing since the lobotomy. Entertaining America. You see, I told you, simple. Yeah, that was a real breeze. Say, CJ, you gotta get it in your head that this is everyday shit, homie. Okay, look, I'm tired. I'll see you later. All right, Holmes. Just think about what I said. Yeah, this is Jack. Making it as an extra in major motion pictures. Then, I will explain the secrets of the universe to everyone. But first up, stack the decks in which I, Billy Dexter, meet the entertainers in the news. Kiflo. Jack Howitzer, once the biggest star in America, but the last three years have been unkind. People describe him as a dinosaur, an action hero relic from the 80s, a muscle-bound Neanderthal, and my favorite, the most stupid gorilla in the jungle, Jack. Welcome to the show, Kid Flower. <laughs> Good to be here, Dex. Pleasure. So your movies Exploder and Annihilator got America through some tough times, and I was also a huge fan of, of Zero Seconds to Death Thank time you, thing. thank you. But many say your new film has gone too far. No, this is a romantic comedy with drama. It's got action. It's got a heart. That's what's most important. OK, well, let's take a listen to the trailer. All right, let's roll that. He was a man at war with himself, fighting a war that someone else lost. It's over, Tim! The war is over! It's never over! You've seen him wipe out millions of Cambodians in Exploder. Now, Jack Howitzer is Tim oh, in his most now. challenging role yet. Oh, you dropped your paper. I'm about to lock up on this fool. Of to special ed kids. One of you tards has been running Peruvian flake through the special ed school, and I'm gonna find it. No juice and cookies. You know you sucked here. But soon he becomes one of them. What is this? That's teacher's gun. You wanna see it? Cool. Oh, you gone and shot yourself. Way to go. He was finally beginning to live a normal life. Then all hell. Breaks loose. Tim, you're so stupid. You count with your fingers. You want to party with me? Bring it on! Tim, what are you doing? I fought for my country. Welcome to the land of freedom, bitches. Hey, CJ! Baby, what's up, man? What's happening, Smoke? Chillin'. Wanna go for a ride? Yeah. You drive. All right. We going downtown. Problems of life you'll be throwing up. This better not be another cop errand, man. No, man, this is strictly for the home. 
I gotta be honest with you, DJ. We could be getting into some heavy shit, man. Hey, look what out. you went to, Smokes? A lot of shit about to go down, Paul. Families coming back, ballers pushing base, Russian cats with nothing to lose about the fucking ass. Russians? Now, all my life, I've been told to fear the Russians. But I ain't never even met one. Then the wall comes down and we all supposed to be friends. Five minutes later, my cousin gets laid out by some Russian fresh off the boat. For real? For real. Time to do something, a film that made a difference. Yeah, but Ho Chi was a character. Exploder was a movie. Right, right. And I was... Look, Cole, before I walk in there, I just need to know you down with this shit, man. Look, Smoke, we go way back. We grows, man. That's what I'm talking about. That's my dog. Hey, look, if you hear shit start to pop off, come in here blasting, all right? I'm down, dog. Hey, baby, want company? Motherfuckers! See, they get in here! Oh, they use the cover! They blasting like fools in this motherfucker! Ice those fools, CJ! Bitch, look, you make big mistakes. Watch yourself, CJ! I think they pissed! CJ, take the right and cover my ass! Keep it up, baby! That's my dog, making y'all pay! Stick real close, Carl! Keep your hands down the head and stick your shit in here! Smoke, you and your friend are dead men. Motherfucker, back me up! That's my homie, CJ! <laughs> homie, you ice cold, baby! Time to return the favor, baby! Get on! Go around! 
Pounder, man. Screw that. We're taking a city group. murder of Officer Ralph Pendlebury, whose body was found recently. Pendlebury worked for Internal Affairs. We lost him, Smoke. Man, we better split up. I'll take it another block and dump it. Man, that was some crazy shit back there. Yeah, for sure. Listen, we can't hang around here. I'll see you later, homie. Much love, baby. I began lobbing balls of fire at his house and burnt down an entire neighborhood. It's inexcusable. The man. Lawyer, I'm gonna be rich. Seems fair enough to me. I'm Leanne Forget. That was the news. Be safe out there. Relationships can seem like an eternity. You asshole! What were you doing with my sister in that hot tub? Relieve the pressure. Ice. Chill that bitch out with ice. A diamond lasts forever, but your relationship might not. A diamond is love, rock hard, and frozen in time. Luckily, most women are shallow and materialistic. Oh, a diamond! So you do love me. Nothing says I love you like a lump of carbon mined by wage slaves in Angola. I don't even know what I was mad at you about. Do you want a blowjob? Passion. It can be purchased, and it can be overpriced. Ice, available and very expensive at Decock Diamonds. It's a favorite show with serial killers and stalkers. Lonely Hearts is next. All through the sultry anonymity of night and some of the day, you're on Lonely Hearts on WCTR, West Coast Talk Radio. Or as I like to call it, we can't talk right. I love you all. I'm your host, Christy McIntyre. Hey, Ryder, what the hell you doing? I think I couldn't find that wet I buried. So I'm making my own. Strong. It's easy, fool. Man, don't do that. You'll saute the both of us. Morning, boys. Man, who you calling boy, fool? Well, what should I call you, midget? How about prick? Prick. Yeah, prick works. Man, fuck you. Bitch, get out of here. Mmm, smells good. What's cooking? Where's mine? Man, just chill out, all right? Ooh. Yeah. Sweat me. Mmm. My wife loves this stuff, man. <laughs> anyway, there's a train gonna make an unscheduled stop just down the way. And it's got a, how you say, little something something on board for you, boy. Square business, man. Catch you later, homeboys. Asshole. Oh, Carl. Try not to kill any more respected police officers. Please. Crime has certainly gone up since you got back, kid. <laughs> Just doing my part for the community. Your train's gonna be there in five. Concentrate on the road, then. <laughs> you love to give a homie a hard time. 
I'm trying to keep my soldiers alive, nigga. By nagging them to death? Watch the road, motherfucker! The road! Yeah, here we go. That's our train, all right. Shit, look like some north side vagos got it first. That's the problem with liberals. They don't know when to shut up and enjoy freedom. Let's go to the phones. Uh, yeah, hi. Here's the deal. I'm really funny, but nobody wants to hire somebody funny. I, I mean, how is that fair? I, I mean, I'm white, middle class, very arrogant. Get back to the road. Oh. People just respond badly to me. I, I don't understand it. Are you related to my husband? <laughs> uh, <clears throat> uh I, I don't think so. I hope not. Have you got a question about politics? Yeah, sure. I know a lot about politics. Hey, can I do your job? You know, I used to be on the radio back in the day. Even my husband can't do his job, you strange, pathetic little sap. <laughs> Let's have a real caller, please. Hi, my name is Michelle. I'm a first-time caller to the show. I wanted to know what you guys thought about the proposition to ban smoking. Well, this is a simple issue. Smoking. Democracy at work again in our state. Seems like a good thing when you... Damn, homie, your stuff was tight. Yeah, you too, homie. LB's coming over to stash the shit. Okay, later then. For life, CJ. For life, you heard? Finish high school. Cause you've been dealing drugs, man, since the age of 10. No, that ain't it. <laughs> Cause you have put hands on that teacher for wearing baller colors. <laughs> no, that ain't it either. It's cause 
I'm too intelligent for this shit, man. I am the real deal, fool. Oh, shit. A genius. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Who has more straps than anybody? Who has all the straps, huh? Uh, a man with a lot of guns. Shit, I give up. The army, my nia. The army. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. Get that out my face. Go ahead. Oh, come man. on, man. Come on. Buster. You think you can roll this van without killing us both? Hey, Ryder, where we going? Ocean docks. How we get this van? It wasn't outside when I came through. My homie LB, he like a clockwork ninja. Real dependable. Unlike some of you motherfuckers. Give it a rest, man. I lost my little brother, and now I lost my mom. Don't matter how much shit the city throw at you. CJ, you gotta stick by your homies. Yeah, yes. Who's that man? There's a garden full of corpses, and you're talking about money laundering. Yes, it's a great opportunity for some profit-centric okay. thinking. You missed a wonderful opportunity to talk about recycling and organ donation. Oh, God, give me strength. I married a fool. I married a fool. You know, when we first met, Peyton, I thought you were so glamorous mm -hmm. with your long hair and... This is the spot, National Guard Depot. Man, this shit look real serious. Are we up for this? It's National Guard, fool. We get soldiers. Ain't no match for Grove Street OGs. <laughs> hey, stop where you are! What was you saying? You want more of this? Nice job, CJ. Thought that was a suicide mission for sure. Now open the warehouse and keep these motherfuckers busy. Okay, we in. Move, Ryder. What's poppin' now? I watch our backs while you use the forklift to collect the crates. Okay, homie, let's load this shit up. Shit, CJ! Shit! There's more outside. This 
too many damn weekend soldiers. Come on, CJ. We got enough. CJ, get up front and drive us out of here. Hello? LB got us a spot in Willowfield. Hit the gas. Damn, man, these idiots just don't give up. What's happening back there? These part-time soldiers got a chip on their shoulder. Nice rhymes, man. Hey, we real heavy. Toss some crate. All right, check it out. Sound the horn. I throw a crate at him. An exploder? I mean, I I thought it was time to do something. A film that made a difference. But Ho Chi was a character. Exploder was a movie. Right, right. And I was there. And I should kill them all. Don't push me, Dex. I'll give you a war you won't believe. That look in your eye, right here, right now. Okay. Oh, got um, Jack. Jack. Uh. All I'm saying, I ain't rolling with you no more, man, till you off that water, homie. It messed with your mind. Whatever you say, fool. You don't know what's going on. And what that mean? I ain't listening to no more of your bullshit. We got the guns. You ain't no gangster, homie. You, you, you what, smooth? You don't want no trouble. I keep it real. You wouldn't know real if it came and hit you in your... That shit was tight. Tight? Man, that shit was shit. Man, you say you down for the homies, but all you do is complain. Thank <laughs> you.